Welcome everyone. Here is how to turn off iPhone Air with the touchscreen working and I'll also cover if the touchscreen is not working as well. So first of all, if your touchscreen is working, we can press and hold both power button and volume up together. So press and hold these two together and then release when you see this uh, slide power off screen and you can just slide to power off like this. Now, if your power button stops working for whatever reason, you can turn off iPhone Air by going into your settings app. Then scroll all the way down until you see general. Then scroll down to the very bottom and you see the shutdown option. And when you select this, you have the same slider power off. Now, if your touchscreen is not working, you can't use those two solutions. So first of all, if your touchscreen is not working, to turn off iPhone Air, we're going to connect the phone to a computer. So connect this to Windows computer, to Mac computer. If you connect this to the charging brick, this step won't work. So we're gonna do a key combination. I'll show it first and then we'll do it. So we're gonna click release volume up, click release volume down, click on all the power button, we're going to keep this one held down until we see the Apple logo. And then we're just going to keep on holding until we see the computer screen. So pause the video, prepare your phone. I will begin in three, two, one. Click release volume up, click release volume down, click on the power button, keep this one held down. Now you probably won't see this slider power off screen. Don't worry, just keep on holding. What you should see is the screen will eventually go black. That's good. If you don't see this, just rewind the video, try again. When we see the Apple logo, I'm still holding down the power button. And when I see this screen, I'm gonna release. Now it shows the connect to computer iTunes screen. Just unplug your phone. And after about five minutes, this screen will go away. The phone will turn off and it won't turn back on. If you were wanting, just to forcefully restart the iPhone, then just wait five minutes when the screen goes black, just press another power button and it will turn back on. Now real quick, YouTube do not promote my videos like they used to. So if you found this video useful, it really would mean the world to me if you hit the like button down below and just left a comment saying, hey, I found this video useful, thank you. If you did not find this video useful, any questions, any concerns, just let me know in the comments I'll try my best to get back to you. Have a nice rest of your day. Bye-bye.